Sir, you also mentioned about the, uh, about the, I mean, how the Kurds actually dream about the greater uh, Kurdish states, the prospect of Kurdish state. What do the Israelis think about that? I mean, I know that uh, Iran and Turkey doesn't want that happen, but what do the Israelis think about a prospective Kurdish state in the future? Well, I think uh, Israel is looking for its own interests uh, mm -hmm. uh, in terms of national security. Right. I know for sure, and I can tell you, Israel has been supportive of the Kurds in Iraq. Mm -hmm. And they have been selling the Kurds in Iraq weapons, training, and all of it because it served their interest against Saddam Hussein. Mm -hmm. That's that, why. That's, that is a, was an open secret, mm -hmm. but it was, it was mm -hmm. not. Uh, they probably would do the same in supporting uh, the, the Kurds in Syria if it should the opportunity arise. Do you think that they do that right now? They won't because they, will not. Uh, they, they won't because they have more interest in restoring relations with, with, Turkey. with Turkey. And so they will be wait to wait and see. But Iran is supporting the Kurds in North Iraq, right? Uh, absolutely. I mean North Syria. Yeah, absolutely they do, they do so. So, so Israel has this double interest in a way. It would like to restore relations with Turkey because Turkey is the major power in the Middle East especially. Mm -hmm. And it's the only Muslim outside the Arab world that, can, that Israel has had good relationship with and it's, it's in a way it's lost. Uh, so there's a, it's a balancing act for the Israelis. But they will not stop supporting the Kurds in, in Iraq because this gives the Israelis a certain advantage uh, in the region that, that goes beyond the Israeli borders. Mm -hmm. 